with its gigantic pillars of stone thrusting skyward, is one of the world's truly awesome landscapes. Astutely described as the Thebaid of Thessaly, this enclave in the northwest corner of the province, lying between the mountain massifs of Antihasia and much sung Pindus, near the silver eddies of the swift flowing Peneos, is one of the most important concentrations of monasteries in Greece, second only to the over 1,000 year old monastic state of Athos. The untrodden windswept summits of the huge heaven kissed pinnacles of rock were the goal of those first audacious hermits. Seeking spiritual quietude, salvation, and serenity far from the tumult, the turbulence, and the storms of this world. Armed only with determination, an inflexible will, and a deep and abiding faith in God. Soaring like eagles on the wings of the Holy Spirit, they scaled the heights and erected their simple cells. They climbed those rugged and waterless stone pillars, where earth and heaven seem to join together to glorify the Creator in hymns of praise. And like the birds of the air, roosted in the hollows and on the parched plateaus, rejecting the secular life in their passionate and resolute zeal and love for the holy and unique angel-emulating state. For where God wills, the natural order is overcome. But, however marvelous and enrapturing the landscape, it was the Creator that these godly-minded men adored, not His creation. There, with their unceasing and ever-vigilant prayers, their unimaginable spiritual labors and toil, their ascetic delvings and wrestlings, they steadily established the foundations and solidly raised the perceptible ladder that leads to the heavenly mansions and finally to the sight of and to union with God. Meteora.